you belong with me in deep darkness. I will show you the secrets of the universe and the cosmos alike. I am the end of time, bane of existence and an emissary of the sixth plane, the nightmare of next. Fear me, mortals, for Sathagwa gives no warning. It's gooey? Then tell us already. Er, sorry. Please tell us. Oh, wow. Humility from Byakuya? Yeah. That's enough, Hina. It's not! It is. Actually, no. <laughs> Jesus Christ! <laughs> if this game could be summed up in three lines of dialogue. <laughs> Sakura, Sakura, Sakura? <laughs> Mazel tov! And the punishment is... We're bringing her back to life! And then death. Why did you try to cover up what happened? I couldn't let her be the only one that died. We'll have to pay for our crimes. Five dollars, please. For serious? That's ridiculous. If the mastermind demands that I kill someone, then that someone will be me! Then my dojo will be safe, and above all else, none of you will have to kill anyone. Man, Sakura's a good lady. She stole my fave. Hey, I'm Grump! I'm not so Grump! And we're the Game Grumps! Hello, I love you. Give me your friends. Uh, I don't ba, know. Ba, 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 ba. <laughs> what is this song? Uh, yeah, about? I don't know what that means either. Okay. <laughs> um, but yes, okay, so we discovered that uh, Sakura had killed herself, and mm -hmm. now uh, we are dealing with the aftermath of that conversation. Yes. Um, so please go ahead with Kyokoko. Okay. That's why she killed herself. Tune in to the last episode of Game Grumps if you'd like to understand the, uh, what she's talking about. Yeah. She chose death for herself in order to protect the rest of us. Never mind what I just said. <laughs> Kyoko just summarized it. To sacrifice so much, no normal person could do that. However... It was only her limitless strength that made it possible. <laughs> <My lady. laughs> Hina, I want to apologize to you especially. <laughs> I'll miss you most of all, Scarecrow. When you gave me a candy, I took an extra candy, and I, I very I apologize so much for that. I'm so sorry. The reason I didn't tell you any of this is because I knew you would try to stop me. I, I really cannot forgive you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so pissed off right now. God, I can kill you again. I'm really truly <laughs> sorry, but please don't be sad or mad or glad. That would be weird too. If I can thwart the Mastermind's plans, if I can keep you from killing each other, that's enough for me. It's not gonna happen. You're obviously gonna keep killing, but still, I guess a girl can dream. If you were sad or glad about me being mad, that would be bad. <laughs> <laughs> Definitely not rad. Anyway, say hi to Chad. This is the path I have chosen. This is the only way I have left to distinguish myself. And yet you can use this note to bring the class trial to a quick end. I'm so sorry to ask you to do something so unpleasant, but I have to leave the rest to you. Please talk to Byakuya, Toko, and Hiro on my behalf. They'll totally believe you. I can't tell Tell anyone. them I'm sorry that I smashed their bottles with my head. <laughs> yeah. It was really uncool of me. I can't tell anyone about my plan while I'm alive, but I wanted you to understand why I'm doing this. In the end, though, I- She wrote all this on that one sheet of paper? So in the end, <laughs> yeah, seriously. In the end, though, I hope to show myself through actions and not words. Hopefully, then they'll see. I never saw you as my enemy. You were only ever my friend. Oh. Who I wanted to help as much as possible. Hina. Yeah, she starts yeah, writing at the top all big, and then it <laughs> gets smaller and smaller. <laughs> it's all a lot squished than I thought up. It would be. Sorry. <laughs> yeah, and then it says over with a little arrow, <laughs> tell you to flip the page. No matter. <laughs> it kind of curves, the word like curves down. Yeah, yeah, the word curves down the side, totally. <laughs> I can't read! <laughs> Somebody read it to me! This is... I didn't understand how she felt, not at all. I thought we were close and still. 
what are you gonna do? But in the in the end, all her but battling is end. like totally pointless. Aww. She died so you guys wouldn't try to kill each other, but you almost ended up doing it anyway. Thanks to you, her death had no purpose at all. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, you're such a dick. In fact, it was because of her stupid meddling that the rest of you nearly bit the big one. Too bad. She deserves all the blame. Everyone blame her. Go ahead, she deserves it. <laughs> <laughs> now then, the next victim has been decided. What do you mean, next victim? Nobody here blames anyone. Huh? First of all, you're in the wrong for tricking Hina with that fake suicide note. And second of all, when has logic ever worked against Monokuma? <laughs> yeah, seriously, he, he runs the whole show, man. And plus, Sakura's death wasn't a waste! What? Because she made We got us... to have a nice conversation! <laughs> yeah. She made us remember, except for maybe Byakuya. <laughs> We're not enemies that hate each other, except for maybe Byakuya. We're friends! We need to work together! Except for maybe Byakuya. You know? Damn straight. This is all because of our misplaced hatred. Well? I don't blame her, I can't blame her, and nobody can blame Hina either. You know, a good place to start would be to stop calling her Ogre. <laughs> yeah. Boo what? Whether or not there was a spy never really mattered, because the one we need to destroy is you! Nobody- <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, seriously. What, what the heck? How's that that? That's not how this is supposed to go. But anyway, are you sure about that? This killing game is a competition between all of you, remember? Your enemy is each other. <laughs> Excuse me. He's absolutely right about that. Ah, oh, lovely Byakuya. You understand, don't you? This is a life or death elimination match. The only way to survive is to win. There can be no doubt that those are the rules of the game. Which is why I'm bowing out of the game. Damn! Uh, da uh, damn! 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 <laughs> Sakura and Hina were both willing to sacrifice their own lives to deny the reality of the game. Thanks to them, it would appear that the others have cast aside their fear for this game. Don't make me repeat myself. There's no point in participating in a game which has lost that sense of excitement. Which is why I will no longer be participating in it. I mean, you weren't really participating to begin with. You didn't kill anyone. Yeah, I mean, you've been kind of weird. Oh, well, well, what's going on here? Now I have only one thing to look forward to. Dance class at nine. <laughs> and that is to heap the harshest possible punishment onto the one who thinks they can control me. Oh, damn. B is he turning baby face? Yeah, but Byakuya, does this mean... Don't misunderstand. I still think you're a dick and I'm gonna touch my classes constantly. <laughs> I haven't been moved by some thoughtless sentimentalism, if that's what you're thinking. Wherever well, master goes, I go! And if the master turns out to be a guy, maybe I can catch you on fire! Uh, everyone! <clears throat> what the fuck does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> well, now can you say that Sakura's death had no meaning? Oh, how boring. Yeah. But nothing good can come of this. I'm still gonna be the one having the fun time. The heck? The fun time? Anyway, let's forget about that good for nothing backstabber and get on back on track. It's the moment you've all been waiting for punishment time! What? Wait, but Sakura was technically the killer, right? She's dead! You're not gonna. Is it me? Oh, heavens no. Just because the blackened is dead doesn't mean I can just sub in whoever else do it I want. Damn! Didn't I tell you? I'm very particular about the bear times one rule. Listen up. But I spent so much time prepping my special punishment, it'd be a shame to let it go to waste. So for my special punishment, I've prepared a special guest! A uh, special guest? Let's give it everything we've got! It's punishment time! Okay. What the hell is gonna happen? I have no idea. Oh, it's Alter Ego. Oh no, not Alter Ego! <laughs> um... Oh, that's so sad! What did Alter Ego ever do to anybody? <laughs> well, she tried to hack into the system. Oh, yeah. Mmm, this sucks. <laughs> I'm just a computer, so it's like, whatever. Yeah, this raises a lot of questions about AI rights. <laughs> yeah. I'm sure someday we'll have a big oh. conversation about it in 2060 or whatever. Yep, excavator destroyer! Oh! Ow, 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 ow. It doesn't really hurt. I'm a computer. <laughs> Damn. 
This is messed up. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> can't look at his floppy. I can't stay mad at him. <laughs> it's just a floppy little bear. And there we go. Oh. Oh, he like sculpted it into a little ball, huh? Yeah. It's kind of beautiful. What a great dude. He's an artist. Really. Real cool. Real cool, Monokuma. You! You destroyed a computer! <laughs> you suck, man! You turned him into a mangled hunk of junk! Ooh, I really took it out of me. Maybe I'll go grill up a plate of chicken. After all, they say for post-workout grub, chicken's where it's at. And I'm all about the grilled goodness! <laughs> Fried? Broiled? Give me a break. The color, the smell, the succulents, grilled is where it's at! Aha! <laughs> I realize how dangerous it could be, but still, I have to do this. But I'm scared, but I can handle it. I really don't understand why, but, but still, uh, when I think about everything else, my current starts to grow. You might think I'm just some inhuman AI, but it's true, so it's okay. Uh, it's, 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 it's for the sake of everyone else, I won't be afraid. <laughs> Alter Ego's words raced through my mind, my heart and soul. Not my mind. And my disbelief <laughs> gave way to raw anger. The anger turned to fury. The fury led to hate. The hate led to the dark side. Black and muddy and <laughs> boiling over. It bubbled through my body, quickly overflowing and shooting out of my mouth. I vomited all over everyone. How dare you! That was my friend! My only friend! How dare you kill him! What's the matter? Huh? You were friends with a laptop? That's pretty pathetic. What's next? Friends with a basketball? <laughs> Shut the hell up! He wasn't just a laptop, he was my friend. And you killed him! Is this what you call animism? Where a soul dwells within all things, even like laptops? I think it's Shintoism. Well, you can call it whatever you want. Bottom line is, it got in my way! It was trying to find things out all sneaky sneaky. Just as I thought. <laughs> so, you finally noticed him. Actually. Finally? No, no, I knew about it from the very beginning. I know Chihiro was doing something with the laptop, and I knew you were using it to analyze data. I knew exactly how it was all going to play out from the start. Uh, so you what? didn't think we were all having a sexy bath together? You knew, and you were still cocky enough to let us take the plunge? Yep. Well, I mean, the data on the laptop, it was, uh, I guess you could call it a gift from me to you. I may be more like a reward in honor of you being able to unlock something so difficult. Hey, um... So, of course I didn't care if you got access to that. But sneaking into the network was just too personal, so I had to do a little, you know, reformatting. I want to be able to help. I want to keep being helpful to everyone. I want to work as hard as everyone else so that we can all get out of here. So I'm gonna go on Reddit and see, <laughs> see what everyone's saying. Alter Ego <laughs> wanted to fight for us. He wanted to help at the risk of his own life, and for that he was killed. Who, who, who? Yeah, punishment time has made me feel a billion times better. Experiencing a meaningless death is so soothing! Makes me remember how every low can get even lower. No! This death wasn't meaningless either! <laughs> Everybody- No! <laughs> ah, everybody has died so far! The deaths of each and every one of our friends. They'll make us stronger! I swear to God, someday you will pay for this! Holy moly, or super mad. Like, just unreasonably upset. Well? Okay, time to bring things to a close. Oh, but before that, uh -huh. I need to read the postscript. What? Postscript? Yep. Yeah, there's just still a bit more left of Sakura's note. Huh? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Take care of my hamster. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Do I have your attention? Okay, then here we go. Prepare your ears for the dulcet tones of yours truly. One other thing, Hina. There's something I'd like to tell the others. Hopefully it will act as a clue to help you unravel the mystery of this school. What? A clue? Hina. And now it's me. I have spoken with the mastermind off and on the whole time I've been here. And so I've learned one thing, which is the mastermind has done something to us. I think what they've done is... Yeah! Oopsie daisy, that was a close one. Another word and we would have been hip deep in spoiler territory. Ugh. Okay, I don't want to ruin the surprise, so book club is dismissed for today. What? You can't just stop at the most important bit. <laughs> it makes your brain rumble and tumble, huh? It makes you so mad you don't even friggin' know, huh? You guys? 
That's the whole point, stupid! It's to get back at all of you for hardening your resolve. Fine, but at least Sakura's note. Give it to me. Like I'd ever let any of you grease balls have it. But, 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 <laughs> but I condition my hair every day. It's not sucks greasy. For, it sucks for you, loser. Wait, what's this? What is it now? There's one last line in the note. Let me just say this to the mastermind. Fuck you! Fuck you! I'm not going to just lay down and die. I will fight you. <laughs> I'll be sitting upright. <laughs> yeah. You bastard. No matter what. And that's seriously it. Hmm? Huh. Wow. What a stubborn loser, huh? She won't lay down and die. She'll fight you. Well, whatever. Who cares what some dead muscle head has to say? Well, okay, I'm out of here. You guys should try to get some rest, you know? Maybe take some time to reconsider how you approach this school life of yours. Are you sure you didn't want to graduate? Can you really cut free from the regrets of the outside world? Hoo hoo hoo, think about that. Think long, think hard. And that's it. Those were his parting right. words to us before disappearing. Whoa. He left us dangling like a participle. <laughs> <laughs> but what was that all about? Sakura's final message, her last clue to help us solve the mystery of this school. The mastermind did something to us? Kyoko said something like that before, didn't she? It was after Celeste's trial was over. You. What did you do? What did you do to my body? Who? What? Hey. Answer me. What did you do to my body? The mastermind did something to our bodies. What are they saying the mastermind did? What did the mastermind do to us? Are we all Avril Lavigne style clones? I mean... Wait, what? Avril Lavigne has clones? Yeah, of course. Avril Lavigne died right after Complicated and she was replaced by a clone. Didn't you know that? Is that right? Yeah, yeah, of course. Everybody knows that. That sounds like a really, 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 really smart theory. Yes, I agree. <laughs> Did the mastermind plant a bomb in us or something? And if we try to leave the school, a sensor goes off and the bomb explodes? I've seen stuff like that in movies and comics and stuff, but it's not totally unheard- so it's not totally unheard of. You mean to tell me that my favorite Avril Lavigne song, Hello Kitty, was written after she died and made by a clone? Well, I mean, the clone doesn't write the music, Dan. The clone- the- the producer writes the music. The clone just performs it. Lip syncs it, really. Oh. Alright, that I can see. Yeah. Because the clone doesn't actually sound like a Verlevine. That would be ridiculous. Uh, they have- Just kidding. This is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> no, I feel like- I don't want one single person out there being like, uh, Game Boys think this- thinks that Avril Lavigne- <laughs> <laughs> We don't. We don't think that. <laughs> no, I feel awful just thinking about it. I can't afford to acknowledge thoughts like that. Yo. So the class trial is over and Monokuma's what? gone. So now what do we do? Yes. What else is there other than to head back up and make out on the elevator? <laughs> yeah. Sit around with butt plugs. Sorry. Um. I mean... Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's get out of here. But... Yes, but plugs. I, um... <laughs> Hina must feel or still feel responsible. I agree, Hina. It's gonna be awkward as fuck up there, considering we've all accused each other of murder <laughs> yeah. now. Oomph. Dial back that ego a bit, girl. Oh. Damn, Byakuya's such a dick. Yeah, fucking pot the calling of, the kettle black here. Yeah, the kind of mystery someone like you could pose is absolutely no threat. Not possible. I would never have lost to that kind of challenge. You literally did. You literally lost yeah. to that kind of challenge just now. Yeah. What are you talking about? Kyokyo and Makoto are the ones that figured everything out. Stop talking. Shut up. Hmm. Seriously, I'm sorry. How many times do you plan to apologize? How about you make that the last one? I haven't reached a point where I need someone apologizing me to me more than once. Sorry. Okay, I see what you mean. Then, <laughs> sorry. I'll try. Huh? Huh? I'm here too, by the way. That that, that totally wasn't normal, right? Did she just capture his flag? No, 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 no. No, 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 no. I cannot suffer the existence of someone who would disturb the romance between me and Master. Oh, God. What are you talking about? There's absolutely not what's happening here. Why would I ever go for a sleazeball like him? What did you say? 
sleaze ball. Oh, is that where he draws the line? What the heck? That's right, I called you a sleaze ball because you are a sleaze ball. Apparently, you still have a death wish. <laughs> Why is he suddenly so sensitive? Ah, yeah. More biting sarcasm? No wonder you don't have any friends. No, 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 no! Hey, stop fighting with Master! You're making me jealous! I want the abuse, give and take me! Guess it's not <laughs> I guess it's not so easy for everyone to act like friends. Well, that's just how it is for now. The <laughs> end. <laughs> yeah, seriously. Time. We didn't murder each other. <laughs> yeah. The wacky septet or no boy. What's what's five? Five? Well, there's six of us. Cause there's really? five and then me. Oh, all right. So the wacky sextet walked off into the distance, holding hands and being friends forever. <laughs> and so, Just kidding, someone's about to die. Oh yeah. And so Sakura's class trial came to an end, and we returned to the world of Hope's Peak Academy. That really does sound like... And we live happily ever after. But the story Seriously? wasn't even close to over. There's like five more chapters left. Time kept marching on. And all we all went back to our rooms, and before long, night snuck up on us. Oh, it's been so long since we've gotten to spend time in our gorgeous room. Ding dong, bing bong! <gasps> hey, everybody! Sorry about earlier. <laughs> this is a school I have. Yep. Nighttime, bed so bugs okay, bite. Alright. Nighttime descended, then pulled me down along with it, down into sleep. Wow. It woke me up inside. Can't wake up. <laughs> yeah, it's like waxing so <laughs> poetic right now. I couldn't remember the last time I'd fallen into such a deep sleep. <laughs> what, did he die? Like, But the night still wasn't <laughs> over for me. A voice. I could hear a voice. Wah wah. Wah. Ka. K. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. Wake up. <laughs> Man, huh? Voice dragged me from deep slumber into hazy self consciousness. My ally, I, wherever. <gasps> Kyoko. <gasps> Kyoko? Romance? Finally, romance? Yes, it's me. Is this the dating sim we've all waited for? I don't think so. Yes, it's me. Kyoko? Uh, it looks like they're talking. I said Great. yes. So Kyoko's here. So, uh. Wait, what? What is, what is it? What is a g g g g g g girl doing in my room? Uh, what are you doing here? Uh, I'm here to wake you up. Oh, I see. Well, mission accomplished. Bye. <laughs> Wait, but my door. It was unlocked. You're unbelievably careless. No, it wasn't. It was unlocked. Are you serious? Always. And you don't have to overreact like that every time you're surprised. What time is it? Three o'clock in the morning, of course. It's 3 a.m.? Why was Kyoko waking me up at this hour? Um... I guess I better talk to her cardboard cutout that just sprang up. <laughs> yeah. Boop. So late, what happened? I have a favor I need to ask. A favor? <laughs> What's your favor? So... Cherry. Remember what Sakura said at the end of her note? I'm not going to just lay down and die. I will fight you. I want to find out what she meant by that. Okay, but how do you plan to do that? Then Kyoko put her lips next to my ear and whispered. I was like, oh. I don't know! <laughs> <laughs> oh. The data center on the fourth floor. What? Goodbye. I'll meet you there. What? Wait, don't fade away! <laughs> Without another word, she was gone. I mean, you know, I, I walked her- I watched her walk out of the room. Uh, yeah. uh, what the? Her words reverberated through my half-dazed head. The data center? But I thought it was locked. Guess I'll okay. go to the data center. The area. Leave the area. I made my way into the after-hours school and headed for the data center on the fourth floor. Eventually, I wound up at the data center. But when I arrived... That's when the drum beat started. <laughs> yeah. Kyoko's not here. That's weird. She said she'd meet me. Oh well, I guess I shouldn't be feeling weird about this. She may be inside already. I put my hand to the door and with a certain amount of force, 
Rattle, rattle. Didn't open. She probably grabbed her drumsticks and was on the ones and twos laying down a four on the floor beat. I tried again, but rattle, rattle. Must be locked. What was it Kyoko said? Data center on the fourth floor? What's this? Oh ho! What are you doing up, mister? Go! Uh -oh. Breaking into a locked room is extremely prohibited, don't you know? Uh, well, I just... You're trying to tell me you didn't actually bust in yet, right? But I can say that you don't. Don't waste my time telling me crap I can see for myself. Look like you might break in at any second. So I just thought I'd give you a friendly reminder. Or are you gonna try and tell me you were sleepwalking or something? No, no. I was something like sleepwalk. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> oh, you're so smart, Monokuma. You're so smart. No, nothing like that. It's three o'clock in the morning for crying out loud. Even I get tired, you know. <laughs> Should be making breakfast or something. Stop being weird and go back to bed. I think that's probably Kyoko. What's wrong now? Just a second. Why are you out here making a racket? Because the whistles go, whoa! Kyoko! <laughs> now you too? Whatever! The two of you just get back to bed. I'm positively exhausted from the class trial. That's true. Sure, you got it. Come on, Makoto, let's head back. Together, holding hands. <gasps> really? Yeah, that's nice. What? <laughs> Didn't you hear me? We're leaving. I have no idea what's going on anymore. Shall we go? You and me both, Makoto. Don't worry about it, let's just go. Oh, okay. <gasps> yeah, yeah, go on, get out of here, shoot, shoot! Freaking. So we left and went back to our rooms. And then... Goodbye. So, goodbye. Oh, hold on! Listen, what was that all about just now? She woke me up, made me go to the data center, which just so happened to be locked. And then she shows up late and we leave without checking a single thing. What was the point of all that? I thought we were gonna make out! <laughs> Don't worry about it. Oh, okay then. <laughs> I figured that would be the end of our conversation, just like always, but... Goodbye. Well then, good night. Sure. And then that was over. Very informative. But as I yeah. turned to leave... <gasps> Mukuro Ikusaba. What? Uh... Mukuro Ikusaba! <laughs> <laughs> Kyoko was right next to me once again, whispering into my Mukuro ear. Ikusaba. Oh! The 16th student, lying hidden somewhere in this school. The one what? The ultimate despair. Um, is that the person who conked you over the head? Probably. Watch out for her. What the, what the what? Wow. What the what? She's an awesome detective, man. She knows stuff. Yeah, but she doesn't tell it to anybody. Hmm. Boop. Seven. Ooh, did you see the new appearance? Yeah. To be continued. Oh, goodness me. Oh, I got an altar lump. Thank God. <laughs> How wonderful. Who would enjoy that present? Yeah, that's when you... <laughs> Never mind. Okay. <laughs> it's when you're in church and you really have to go, but there's nowhere to go. <laughs> oh no! I just dropped an altar lump. <laughs> uh, well, there it is again. Yep. <gasps> Nani? Mukuro Ikusaba. Uh -huh. The 16th student, lying hidden somewhere. <gasps> already, in the school. You already heard this, the dude. The one they call the ultimate despair. Watch out for her. The ultimate despair? What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> despair, despair, despair. <laughs> Kyoko told me to watch out for her. Mukuro Ikusaba. That was three days before the next incident. Three days before we would be faced with another murder. Oh, I didn't really- oh, crap. I didn't really realize this whole time this has been in the past tense. Like, Makoto narrating. So that means he hasn't died. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh, shit! Three days before the worst thing so far would reveal itself. What the fuck? Whoa! Wait. Pain of a junk food junkie? What a whimsical opening to yeah. <laughs> someone being murdered. In the meantime, the day after Sakura's class trial, I was feeling great! <laughs> bo do dio do, -do. <laughs> Had a pep in my step! 
So let's begin the usual post-trial investigation. Hey, you didn't make small talk or anything. We never just get to the street like, to the point like that. Otherwise, how would this game last 10,000 hours? <laughs> if you want to keep up with me, you must refrain from pointless small talk. Jeez, how high is that horse of yours? Well, pretty high. It's a tall horse. Yeah, he, he just acts like that to hide his own insecurities. That's what I like to think anyway. And I'm the ultimate clairvoyant, correct 25% of the time. Regardless, if you want to defeat the mastermind, you need to follow my lead. They creep around the school like a mouse, but the mastermind's pride is as bloated as a cow's udder. Okay, moving on. <laughs> and no matter what it takes, I will rid this world of them. <laughs> and no matter what it takes, I will milk it. <laughs> it's as bloated as a cow's sexy udder. What? <laughs> <laughs> Moving on. If, it, yeah, cut out the sexy part. It, I forget I said that. <laughs> hey, Toko, you've been pretty quiet. <laughs> Man, you're so boring now. You just sit there like a mushroom. I'm gonna start calling you Miss Mushroom. <laughs> People love <laughs> my nicknames. <laughs> yeah. She didn't snap back at you. Her talking makes things difficult, so I told her not to open her mouth without permission. Damn, Yucka. <laughs> What? But if she can't open her mouth, she can't eat or drink water. I don't care. How about that? And you're okay with that, Toko? <sighs> Jeez, how low is that rock you're hiding under? <sighs> it's as low as as high as the horse is. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I believe this is the small talk Pyakya warned us against. Oh, come on. And yet, I let myself get involved. <laughs> stupid, stupid Bjarke, you're stupid! He just like runs out of the room. <laughs> Fucking idiot. God, stop it. I'm so mad at me. But, but it is now finished. I will never allow you to drag me down to your level again. Dude. Or maybe he will next time on Game Grumps. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's see what happens. I know. What who, who who was that? And who got murdered? I think it was probably... Who was wearing the mask? Kote Mukubu or whatever her name is. Was it the new person? Yeah, I think so. Damn, dog! Oh, so much intrigue! You are a sweet little beach. Little beach is you. All you right. are a sweet, sweet little beach.